Obviously, you guys can see it is see-through, so it is quite risque, but again, like, just be a bad bitch. <laughs> What's up guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time joining us, welcome, welcome, welcome to it. I really do hope that you stay, you subscribe and you become a boss. The secret. Family. Now, as I'm sure you can all tell by the title of today's video, today we're going to be doing a Zaful Summer try on haul. I'm super excited to bring you guys this video because the items that I picked, <laughs> everything looks really, really cute. I had an overall really, really great experience, so I'm excited to show you guys all the pieces that I ended up getting. If you guys are excited for this video, please do not forget to give me a huge thumbs up don't forget to comment as you guys are watching the video let me know what your favorite pieces are and of course don't forget to what subscribe subscribe to the thing okay subscribe to the thing if you like it subscribe to it okay now without saying too much else let's get straight into today's video alrighty guys so as per usual we're going to first start off with giving you guys all the information that you need to know when it comes to shipping sizing everything that you would need to know before you actually go ahead and shop on the Zaful website I also do want to put a disclaimer here that this video is sponsored by Zaful however all opinions are my own you guys always know I keep it real with you guys when it comes to my try on hauls so please don't expect that this video will be any different but this video is sponsored by Zaful okay guys so all together I ordered nine items that is including clothing and I did get two jewelry pieces as well everything came up to 1901 South African Rand as far as customers concerned I did not pay any customs that's important to note I didn't pay any customs. I'm so excited about that because guys, one thing about customs and me, they love me, okay? Any chance to make me pay customs, they will. So I was really happy that I actually got to bypass the whole customs thing this time. As far as shipping, I did decide to get the standard shipping and my shipment was confirmed by the supplier on the 23rd of November. I ended up getting all of my stuff by the 11th of December so it did take quite a while let me actually check the exact number of days that it took to give you guys an accurate um, number or ballpark it took about two weeks and a few days but I also do want to mention that the way that it came it came via Buffalo so then Buffalo took my parcel and gave it to Paxi so I actually had to go and collect my things from Tacky Town which this guys was really random and I was really confused by that because normally if I do um, order things from overseas I would expect it to come to my house. I wouldn't expect to go and have to pick it up at a store I don't know if that's a new thing that Buffalo is doing you guys would let me know in the comments if you guys have experienced the same thing But I thought that was strange, but I did think I should let you guys know because that surprised me and it might surprise you guys as well as far as sizing was concerned I feel like to be honest with you everything was true to size even for some of the stuff I would have sized down if you wanted to be like super tight because the material is quite stretchy but yeah, everything is pretty much true to size. Zuffle does not have as many reviews as other websites might have. So it does make it a little bit difficult when it does come to sizing. So I hope this video really does help you guys figure out what sizes you guys should get. Um, also do yourself a favor and watch other Zuffle hauls as well. To see if you can find somebody who's also your size and kind of figure out what size you should get on their website. So yeah, if you guys have any more information you'd like to know, please do ask me in the comments down below. I'm very happy to help you guys. And without saying too much else, let's get straight into the video. Okay, so the first item that I got is this really nice green top. It's a crop top. It has a little halter vibe because you do tie it here at the top. On the website, it's called the Zuffle Jersey O-Ring Backless Halter Top. Now guys, I really, really love this top. I feel like the material is exactly what I expect it to be. It is not super duper thick. As you can see, it is sort of see-through. But also, it's summer, so I'm not looking to get things that are super um, heavy anyways. I was expecting it to be like this. My only qualm is that I still wish I got it an extra small. I don't think there was an option because I would have gotten an extra small. Because I do feel like it doesn't give me the support that I would need. So unless you have like super duper perky boobs... I would recommend you getting a size down. I'm actually looking on the website now. The smaller size is small, so I don't know. I'm definitely gonna be altering it, but it is a nice top and I'm definitely gonna wear it. Out of 10, I would definitely rate this top. 
because of the sizing and stuff, I'll give it a seven and a half out of ten. It is a basic also, so it's not anything to be wowed by. But it's a cute top. It's a cute top. So next we have another crop top. Crop tops, guys, are the wave. Also, like, it's not even that I'm in like such great shape. I just feel like I just want to be naked. Like, <laughs> I don't want to wear clothes. <laughs> but anyways, I got this one shoulder crop top situation. I don't even know how to show you guys in a way where you're gonna see. But you guys will be able to see in the try-on portion of the video, but you can kind of get the gist. This is called the one shoulder twist double layered crop top now i will say that the top is super great material I, I didn't tell you guys with my mouth how much the other item was but this one was 211 is it worth 211 i don't know i can't say that it is i can't say that it is worth 211 rand because of the fact that it's just a crop top and like it's nothing to write home about it's cute but i don't know also if you guys can see the way that it fits i would Get it taken in just like the band part it's gonna be a little bit tricky since everything is sort of interconnected but i would get it um tightened just because for me like i need my crop tops so i'm not gonna wear it with a bra it needs to really support me and this wasn't giving that support but it's giving some support more than the last top but not to my standard so for this one i will definitely be rating it i think i'll give it the same 7.5 out of 10 is cute and this one is more stylish so actually let's give it an eight let's give it an eight we'll give it an eight because this one is a little bit more stylish but it's not quite doing what it was supposed to do next up guys we have an item that has had me in a chokehold and when i mean a chokehold i literally mean a chokehold guys i cannot stop buying this top i don't know what's wrong with me i need help i need rehab from infinity tops guys i need <laughs> rehab but anyways, this is an infinity top. There's no way I can sort of show you guys. Basically, an infinity top is just like a piece of material that you can wrap around as a top as many ways as you would like. So yeah, this is just a black infinity top. Nothing spectacular or anything to write home about. It's a really great basic though. What I did really and what I do really enjoy about it, again, is the material, guys. The material is super, super sturdy, not see-through, which is something that I was worried about. I was like, I hope it's not flimsy material. That is going to bore me a lot. So I really, really appreciated the fact that it is nice and sturdy. This does come in a one-size-fits-all, which I think is valid because it is super duper long. Like, it's hella long. So, um, any size that you are, I feel like it generally will fit because it is really long material. I don't normally like the material on my finished tops to be super long. That's why I do prefer the sizing. But I don't mind this. I feel like it's something different. And I feel like probably I'll be able to style it in more ways since it is a slightly longer. This was 250 Rand. I don't know. I don't know. Listen, I do have an infinity top and different one. But I will say the material is a little bit thinner than this. And I think I, I got it for like 150. So maybe you're just paying for that material that they're using because it's a little bit better um, than your regular just standard material that a lot of like... If you get it from the cheaper stores, a lot of the stores use that material. So maybe that's what it is. But damn, for an infinity top, I said damn. Damn. That's crazy. That's crazy to me. In terms of rating, I'm going to rate this one an 8.5 out of... I'm actually going to give it a 9 out of 10. Honestly, like I have nothing to fault it on. It's a cute top. And what I like about infinity tops is that you can literally look like you're wearing something different. Like for at least... Five different styles because to be honest i don't have five more than five to think of but what that's what i like about it, the versatility of the top like gives it more points it gives it a nine like it takes it to nine the only thing that's actually taking it down is the price because like you really tried it <laughs> next up guys we have a dress we're on to the dresses now i didn't buy any pants guys um it's summer, there's no need to buy pants. <laughs> I got this really nice dress. It's in the color coffee. You guys know me in brown. <laughs> Six, no, nine. And I feel like for summer, oh my God, the looks, the looks, the looks. Anyways, um, this is a brown dress. It has two rings. So it rings here in the front and then it has another one just um, below that. It is really cute. I love how it looks on me. My only qualm with this dress is the fact that I just wish the... Um, the straps were a little bit tighter. I just wish everything was a little bit tighter because this is a rib material. So um, it gives a lot more room, like it's more forgiving. So you can definitely afford to go a size down. Maybe I should have gone a size down. But y'all, I'm definitely gonna get this altered. One thing about me, I'll get something altered though, child, because I'm not gonna not wear the dress. The style is cute. Again, I told you guys about the rings. The rings are giving the summer. So out of 10, I will definitely 110% 
rate this one a 9 out of 10. This is really cute. And probably I could have gone a size down. Let's actually check if they have a size down. They do not have a size down. So there wasn't really much I could do. Also, I forgot to tell you guys about the price actually. The price that I bought it for was 333 South African rands. To be honest, these clothes are a little bit better quality than I had expected. So valid. 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 The quality is good. So valid. Valid. Next up, you guys, we have ZX trying to do color again. She's trying, guys. And I hope you guys are seeing that I'm actually trying because, like, it's not easy. But somebody is doing it. So, <laughs> this is the dress that I got. This is, like, what material would I call this? Is, this is called a jersey material here. But... I don't know it's not the exact same as that first top which is also apparently a jersey material this one is a little bit more see-through like this one will show all the contours of your body which is great but like you can't wear with underwear or anything like that because you will see believe me it has really nice detail where you tie it at the back at the top it's very sexy very cape town very much summertime very new year's eve very you know giving what it was supposed to give i really love it um, I actually don't have any problem with this dress, really, because it actually is ex it is exactly what I expected it to be via the material, via how see-through it was. I'm personally not scared of anything being a little bit see-through, because it, it is also summer, so things can be a little bit more risque. It was 276 rand, which, okay, considering the other one is 330, valid, but in terms of rating, I think we need to give her... I'm giving it an 8 out of 10. Like, it's really cute. It didn't wow, like it wasn't like wowed, but I'm definitely going to wear it and it doesn't need any alterations, so I'm not mad at it. Like, I'm not mad, I'm not sad, I am glad. Do you get it? <laughs> Next, guys, we have a dress that I've been seeing. It's definitely trending. I actually would love to know who the original designer was because I know for a Joina that it is a um, replica or a dupe or whatever the case is because I've seen it in too many different places, man. There's absolutely no way. But, okay, it's hot. Okay, it's hot. It is this dress, guys. I don't want to call it even a dress. I feel like it's a cover-up. But one thing about me, <laughs> one thing about me, I'm going to wear this to the club. I'll tell you that for free. I'm wearing this to the club. But this is how it looks, guys. It is a brown, nude, like, cream mixture. It is so gorgeous this ombre the ombre is giving it to me the ombre is giving me everything that i need and it fits me so well like i was so impressed by how well it fits i don't see myself wearing it as a cover -up. also i feel like if i was gonna wear it as a cover-up it would have had to have been one size bigger just to give room for the swimming costume as well but obviously you guys can see it is see-through so it is quite risque but again like just be a bad bitch <laughs> This is called the Knit Ombre Open Work Tank Slinky Dress. It was 276 Rand. Definitely, if we're looking at the different price points for all these different outfits, I definitely do understand. This one is super trendy. I love it. I'm giving her a 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. She's too much. She's too much. She's too damn much. And finally, we have reached our final clothing item piece. And it is a set, a two-piece. So you first have the skirt that has these two little um, drawstrings that you can make it rouge here. And it is a mini skirt, it's mini skirt. And then you have a top that is also, the style is very much trending right now. Um, you guys will see it in the try on part, but this is how, oh damn, damn. This is how it looks. This material, guys, I'll say, is super duper thick. So I was really, really impressed by that. Like, it is hard, sturdy material. They are sold as a two-piece, so you only pay one price, which is really, really great. It's called the Cinch Cutout Crisscross Knitted Two-Piece Dress. Two-piece dress, I don't really get that because it's a two-piece outfit. Okay, so I decided to get this one in a medium because I wasn't sure how the bottom part was going to fit because you guys know that I want to think about that. Thicker than a snicker, thicker than a bottle of earth. Okay? But then the problem came was that the top I feel like is quite big. I don't even know if there's a way that you can really alter it. I might still wear it even just once for pictures and then I'll probably just put it on my yoga store. But yeah, I'm not I'm not quite sure. But like it's cute. So I feel like out of 10, we need to give her a 7 out of 10. Good material, good quality, well priced, but didn't quite fit me how I wanted it to fit me, so she is losing points. 
she is getting deductions <laughs> okay guys so now we are moving on to the jewelry i only got two jewelry pieces so this first piece that i got is called the punk style lock pendant necklace in gold so this is how it looks I i'm gonna show you guys a picture from the website for these ones because i think me just showing it to you like this is not gonna be sufficient but this is how it looks in real life and this is how it looks on the website listen child i personally am a little bit disappointed with how this looks i feel like the pendant looks hungry the pendant is your core this pendant is so skinny i'm like so concerned and then i feel like also the chain itself doesn't look like what i was getting on the website guys i feel a little bit bamboozled here i'm not gonna lie to you actually let's first look at the price the price is 67 rand so really like I wasn't expecting it to be like amazingly and exceed all my expectations. So to be honest, we can give her a seven. We can give her a seven, but it's only 67 Rand. So it's not actually that much of a big deal. I'm not gonna die over it. But like, she doesn't look like what I expected her to look like, if that makes sense. And finally, the last piece that I got was this set of earrings that is falling everywhere. Damn. So this is how the first little piece looks. But I will put a picture on of how it looks on the website here. You get nine different earring sets. Um, and they all look really cute. Like, they look exactly how I expected them to look. So you see there's three hoops on the bottom. And then you have three pairs of studs. And then here they put the rest of my studs. It's all very cute. I'm definitely going to wear every last one of them. Because one thing about me, guys, I love a cute, dainty earring. You can see... I'm a fan, you guys can see I just got a new beard there. Uh, anyways, but yeah, I really love cute, dainty earrings, specifically for the summertime because it's just a nice way to accessorize an outfit and it makes it look more expensive the smaller the hoop. It makes you look like, mm, she got money, you know? She doesn't have to wear like huge She can just wear something small and cute. She's classy, elegant, you know? Exactly. So yeah guys, unfortunately we have come to the end of today's haul. I definitely enjoyed filming this for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed watching it as much as I enjoyed filming it for y'all. If you did, please don't forget to give me a huge thumbs up. Put me back on that algorithm chat. Don't forget to comment. Let me know what your favorite piece from this haul was. What was your best and your worst? Actually, let me know. Best, worst, what was it? If you didn't have a worst, that is also very valid because I actually don't think I had a worst. Everything, I'm going to wear every single one of these pieces. So there has not been a whole way i've actually said that in a while and i love that for myself so yeah guys let me know and also please don't forget to subscribe join the zx family we have so much fun stuff coming in the new year so definitely do become a part and i'll see you all in my next video bye